This is your prayer point. Anytime you are passing through the valley, confess what God says about the situation. David confessed what God said about his situation. When he saw the giants with weapons, with spear, he began to confess what God said. Stop focusing on what is seen. Focus on what God says about your situation. All you need to know is that there are many giants that require to be conquered. Glory be to God, you have a friend, the Holy Spirit, who can eliminate all giants. Ask him to despair every giant in your life. Ask him to do what? Every giant. And keep your solid front. Begin to walk in the light of your confession. Speak in the light of your confession. Talk in the light of your confession. Look in the light of your confession. Think in the light of your confession. Meditate in the light of your confession. Sleep in the light of your confession. Agree in the light of your confession. What is your confession? My confession. I am saved. Jesus is my savior. I am delivered. Jesus is my deliverer. I am redeemed. Jesus is my redeemer. Are you in the light of your confession? Let us see your hand if you are in the light of your confession. You have to stand up now as a man of faith, as a member of household of faith. You have to stand up and begin to boldly confess that I refuse to accept defeat. Even in the face of negative sense evidences. It is true that you have no money now. It is true you have no job. It is true you are facing some difficulties. You know that. But I still refuse. You can still refuse to accept that you have no money. Say I refuse. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You just need to know whom you are. If you remember whom you are, you know you are a new creation. <laughs> when you say you are a new creation, means you are a branch of the vine, a head of God. You cannot be conquered. Tell your neighbor, I cannot be conquered. Trouble may test me. It cannot destroy me. I cannot be conquered. Right now, open your mouth and begin to refuse. Refuse to accept. Refuse to accept. Refuse to accept. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The book of First Samuel. 17 verse 45 then David said to the Philistine you come to me with a sword with a spear and with a javelin but I come to you in the name of the Lord listen what does this mean this means we are to confess what God says about our situation the situation may be rough in the face of apparent defeat, in the face of apparent poverty, people can say that this is, hey, it's dangerous. 
you have to confess what God says about that situation. When God is involved, there is success in failure. Remember what happened to Peter? When Jesus said to Peter, drop your net, he said, I have done this many times. But when Peter now decided to do what Jesus said, he found success in failure. In the face of apparent defeat, refuse to give in to sense evidences. Say, I refuse to accept defeat even in the face of negative sense evidences. I refuse to accept sickness. I refuse to accept poverty. I refuse to accept disappointment. I refuse to accept failure. I refuse Jesus Christ. Whatever is your giant, always remember that you have a friend, the Holy Spirit, who can eliminate all giants. Tell your neighbor, I have a friend, the Holy Spirit. Eliminate all giants right now. Ask him to despair every giant. Ask him to despair. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In God's time, everything is good. There are many promises of miracles. Salvation, healing, blessing, prosperity. What a picture of life. Yet, to reach the blessing, there are many giants that require to be conquered. To reach that throne, there are many giants that require to be conquered. To reach that blessing, to reach that throne, there are many more. Ask your neighbor, what is yours? Your giant could be unbelief, fear, fear of loss, fear of failure, fear of sickness, fear, 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 fear. Fear is more deceptive than Satan. Whatever is yours, always remember you have a friend. Tell them I have a friend, the Holy Spirit, who can eliminate all giants. Remember, you are born to be great. To reach that greatness, there are many giants that require to be conquered. Tell your neighbor, to reach that greatness, there are many giants that require to be conquered.
Tell your neighbor, don't let down. Keep your solid front. Tell your neighbor, don't let down. Keep your solid front. You are a new creation. You cannot be conquered.